In this video, we are going to get our hands on the Flippo Zero WEC from uh, CS Blue Chip. Um, he's really helpful. I've been um, discussing with him on Discord for several days. And today I found the issue from, uh, from my issue. So basically, I was using his apps with like my uh, Pro Controller and my Nunchuck. However, um, they were not recognized and it happened like there are like two PID for both device. Uh, the Nunchuck come um, kind of refreshed with some uh, hardware change, you know, um, definitely for, for, for the black one, I think, uh, some uh, um, change in the Wii uh, console itself. And it seems that he you know also for like the classic Pro Controller. So um, I'm going to put the link uh, below in the description to the Discord where I gave actually like the, the PID that need to be changed in, uh, in the code. So before he is going to, to update it, you could like already um, recompile the code uh, if you want. So keep in mind there is a code in standalone. So you could like add to your own uh, firmware available on GitHub. And there is also like the Rogue Master that is um, including it. Okay. So there is like um, the, the Nintendo um, controller. So there is a typical wiring that you could like uh, use. And I think here like in a little hole, like uh, use your, your pin if you want. But me, I prefer to, to make it maybe more uh, clean in one way. Uh, I bought like this little um, uh, WeChuck uh, PCB. So that's from AliExpress, like uh, I will put uh, a link below. Of course, it's affiliate if you want to, to support uh, the channel. So every time I'm buying some kind of um, piece of electronics, there is like uh, the shipping and uh, it adds up. So you are not forced, of course. Um, so here it's nice, you know, if you go to a yard sale and you want to collect or grab um, a few of game pads let's say and you know the Wii was like a um, casual console and even kids played and smash it somehow so it's nice to to try it out before so let's see how it's uh, look okay so first i'm going just to kind of think a bit oh we need to to plug like the the, con the connector into like the Wii check okay so it's uh, that way. Okay, we are a little click. Then I will I will run it. So it, it really made a nice app application. It made me think about you know uh, high school where like um, I was using Texas Instrument and yeah, really nice interface. Okay. So um, we could see the axis and like the, the button um, working here. And what's really nice also, um, we have such like a way to kind of um, uh, display uh, the, the value. So you could see, you know, if, if you are like facing, let's say the uh, common problem, it seems nowadays, like the drift, if like the, um, the axis is not really centered, this is like going to, to, to show you like kind of uh, a value, like um, different, you know, it's not stable. Okay, here um, you could see like the SID here and the PID. So both here are kind of wrong because I just made like a quick and dirty modification in, in the code where I change the expected like um, uh, bit here um, to, to match my, uh, my PID device. So that will be, I think, the, the only change 
I'm like looking forward now to 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 kind of like um, say this is complete and there is no no more change. So um, thanks um, to to the developer. Let's see uh, when he has time to to update this, this video. I'm really happy to to be able to to find this kind of uh, bugs. Let's say. Because, yeah, if you only have like uh, one type of device, you're not going to maybe uh, think they, they may even change it. Maybe also other revision. So here also something kind of weird. I, I have noticed on my game uh, gamepad here. I'm not sure if it's normal, but you could see. Like the digital like uh, pad. They, they are not moving here. Okay. But if I check here, they're still changing values. So... I don't know if it's just like um, uh, an issue for my device or if like they, they have like different um, not address because yeah it's still like changing uh, or maybe um, the code is not handling like this uh, this this PID uh, well and that that need like uh, additional change. So I, I really have no idea. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm really grateful for having all these apps and I'm just here like to 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 promote them and hopefully uh, uh, bring my two cents if they could be improved. So thank you very much for for watching and stay tuned on the channel. Bye bye.